What's up guys? So I haven't talked to you guys in a while, but I missed you guys and also I got ready, like overly ready. I just got a new lipstick so I figured I wanted to put it on and then I was like, I don't have anything to film. But then I realized I had all this crap right here to show you guys, yes. So I've been saving all this stuff to show you guys in like a fall haul. But yeah, I just want to clean my room and I was like, dude, I need to just film this video already so that I can put stuff away. So yeah, I just wanted to show you guys what I've picked up lately from some stores. I have stuff from Forever 21, DSW, and then I have a few like subscription boxes that I was sent. So I just want to go through all this stuff because I think it's fun and I wanted to show you guys and then I can put it all away. And also I just wanted to say that I'm sorry I haven't been posting very much on this channel. This is, I love this channel so much, but I've been trying to dedicate more of my time to my main channel just to like you know, grow that and everything, but I still love this channel so much and it's so much fun to film, but it is kind of hard to like keep up with editing. Oh, I didn't show you guys, I got this desk recently from Target, I think it's so cute. And what else, do I have any other updates? So yeah, I'm actually getting new curtains as well because um, these curtains are not doing it for me, I don't like them anymore. And I think I've showed you guys my bed multiple times, but I got a new pillow over there, so that's exciting. I still have my 500K balloons that I took for an Instagram picture, I just haven't taken them down yet because there's, I don't know, I'd rather have that up there than like nothing, so it's staying up there for now. Oh, and I also got this um, new little side table from Ross. It was only 40 bucks, which I think is a really good deal. This is like so mid-century modern, it's super cute. I'm using it for my tripod right now, but before it was over there as like a side table. I'm still not sure what I'm gonna do with it exactly. I might put like a plant on it and put it downstairs or like in here somewhere. I don't know. So yeah, I'm just gonna start pulling stuff over here. So I got this recently. It is a, just like a sweater from Forever 21. I already wore it once, so I don't have the tag on it, but I just think it's super cute. I love these colors. This is, this is like so like 70s. So love the 70s. It was just a great era. I wasn't involved in that era, but it was great. I loved it. Then I got this little cardigan and it goes all the way down to the floor. And this is also very 70s inspired. I love this so much. I haven't worn it yet but I can't wait to wear this. It was $25. Then also from Forever 21, I got these earrings, which I'm actually gonna take back. I think they're like a little too big. It's not exactly what I was looking for, but I do want some smaller ones in this print. I just went kind of crazy and like picked these up, but I don't know. I don't think I'm gonna wear those, so I'm gonna return those. And then I also got a few things from Urban Outfitters. I got these earrings. I'm like obsessed with like the round hoop earrings. I think these are super cute. They're like kind of like clear with some like stripes in it kind of. I don't know if you guys can see. And then I got this t-shirt from Urban Outfitters. It's super cute. It has like some embroidery right here. And this was on sale. This was like 11 bucks, which I think was a great deal. And then from Target, I actually recently picked this up. This was only $3. I like the straight across neckline. And yeah, this wasn't even on sale. This was just like originally $3. So thought that was cute and like a nice basic. So I have stuff from all over the place. And so I just recently went to Ross and they had these sweatpants that are like the Fila, which these are like super trendy right now. And these are only 15 bucks, which they originally says that they were supposed to be like 55. So yeah, I just feel like if these were at Urban Outfitters, people would be buying these for like 60 bucks. And then like I was saying, I'm gonna be getting some new curtains. So I picked these ones up. These are the ones I'm gonna be getting. It's like a light pink velvet color. And then it has these tassels. I know they're like kind of, it's kind of like out there, but it looked so pretty when I hung it up. These are the wrong size. So I'm ordering new ones from online, but yeah, I'm just super excited to put these up. I think it's going to make my whole room just like pop and it'll be super nice. So I'm going to show you guys like a whole room transformation when I get these. And then I think either today or tomorrow, I'm going to go and pick up a dresser because I'm in desperate need of a dresser. I have like all of my clothes just like stuffed in my closet right now. And then I don't know, I just am excited to get to my dresser because that will be like one of the last things to complete my room. So yeah, stay tuned for room updates. And then I got this shirt from Target, but I'm gonna return this just because, I don't know, it's, it's a little much. I don't know what I was thinking. I think it was just, I really like Aladdin, but I don't really like this color. So I'm gonna return it. <laughs> and then I did kind of go crazy with the shoes. I bought a bunch of shoes off of DSW because I had like so many coupons and I was able to use them all at once. It was kind of crazy. So yeah, I'm actually, well, I'm gonna return three. I had three extra pairs of shoes and I'm not gonna show you guys because I'm going to return them, but. Yeah, so these, this first pair are these. These are from Lucky Brand and they're just like black. I don't know why I'm showing you what they look like with my hand. That's really weird. It has like all of these right here. It's like suede, I believe. And then usually I'm not a heel person, but I feel like since I moved to LA, there's just like more occasions to like 
wear fancier clothes so i picked up another pair these are actually from kohl's they're the lauren conrad collection but like how cute are these these are just like a nice like dusty rose color and i don't know i just really like these i think these are super flattering on and then i just picked up another pair of white converse these are like the third pair i've owned but I just, I don't know, I don't like when they get like super dingy looking. I love like a nice crisp white pair. I just, you cannot go wrong with these. These are just like a staple. And then I got these pair from Target. Oh, I just like hit myself. This is like my new favorite pair of boots. I think they're so fun. So yeah, I love these so much. They're so cute. And then I just have a few subscription boxes that I was sent. So I just want to go through them really quickly. So this first one is BoxyCharm. I'll have like links to them below if you guys want to check it out. So I have five products in here. And this first one is a mascara from It Cosmetics. Let's see what this looks like. Ah, just like a nice black mascara, which is great. Then we have this leave-in mask for your hair. I'm actually gonna use it right now. Yeah, my hair actually looks surprisingly really good today. I use like this blue shampoo that I just got and it's supposed to like take out the brassiness. I don't know if it did it that well, but I noticed a little bit of a difference, so that's good. Let's try it. Mm, it smells super good. Then we have a Kat Von D liquid lipstick i'm not a huge fan of this color it's like a brown color i just do not look good with brown lipstick and then boxycharm every month they give you like a palette like an eyeshadow palette usually so i think that's super fun this one looks like it's a blush plus eyeshadow and then oh we have some hand cream right here can never go wrong with hand cream can always use some i always put mine in like my car and then i'll just use it like while I'm driving. So that was everything from my BoxyCharm. Now I'm going to be, I should just, I should have done like an Ipsy versus BoxyCharm box actually. So this is their Glam Bag Plus. So this is like super nice because there's like full size products in here. So this first one is a dewy mist setting spray. So I love the packaging. Oily, what is on my face? Oh, it was this stuff. That's fine. Ooh, next, this is, I'm very excited about this because I needed a new uh, liquid eyeliner. So let's see what this one looks like. Just a standard black liquid eyeliner. Oh, that looks so nice. I know it's like tiny, but it's like going on so nicely. I love liquid eyeliner. I like, I always do like a winged eyeliner. Next we have a mascara and this is from Tarte. And it's called Man Eater. Oh yeah, this is a nice one. I love this type of applicator. Next, we have this Morphe highlighter. I absolutely love highlighters. It's like my new favorite, like, makeup product. I keep buying highlighters. <laughs> looks like this. Let's give it a little swatch. Ooh, that looks so nice. It's kind of like goldy. So pretty. I can't wait to put this on. I'm going to just put it on. I think I already have some highlighter on, but... Then we have this bold glitter um, eyeshadow palette from Smashbox. Whoa, look at that. And this one has a bunch of glitter eyeshadow. Ooh, nice. This is a mud mask and an exfoliant. This so it says a 10 minute facial. I have been loving like skincare. I just bought a bunch of other skincare from Ulta yesterday. Spent a little too much money. But yeah, it says gently resurfaces, detoxifies, brightens, tightens, and smooths. I got one of these last month and it came with the same bag, but it comes with a nice little bag. So you can put all your stuff in there. So that's everything for this month's Ipsy Glam Bag Plus. If you guys wanna check out any of this stuff, I will leave them linked down below. So yeah, lastly, I have this subscription box, which is a Goddess Provisions subscription box, which is a little bit out there. I've never had one of these before. But the owner of the company reached out to me and she was like, hey, I want to send you this box. Like, do you want to receive it? It sounded really intriguing, so I definitely wanted to give it a try. So this first one is a sacred self-care ritual um, card set. Basically, these are like um, self-care cards. So if you're ever like needing to like, you know, do some self-care, because that's always a good thing, you can just like take one of these out and then do whatever it says on the card. There's like this one, it says movement. This one says build strength, so go to the gym. This one I would love to receive because it says sweet treat, so you want to treat yourself. This one says write a gratitude list, so I think that's super nice too because it's always a good thing to remember. This one says plan a vacation. I just think the illustrator did a great job on all of these. This one says dance, 
and yeah, it's just super fun. So that was the little card deck. And then we have an eye mask. And if you guys know me, I sleep with an eye mask every single night. Like there's one right over there by my bed. And I just think it's cute. It has like little eyes on it. And then this next thing is pink chai. And actually, if you guys know me again, chai is my favorite kind of tea. So I'm super excited to try this one out. And then we have the sacred space spray. So you spray this and it refreshes the air. Okay, then we have this like rollerball kind of perfume thing. Ooh, wait. Oh yeah, this is so good. Okay, so this is like lavender and like kind of like minty. Lavender mint, I feel like. But this is so calming. This next thing is a spot treatment serum. So that's super great. Let me see what it looks like. My skin has actually surprisingly gotten better. But I might use this if like a big spot comes up or something. So hopefully that'll be good. And then lastly, we have a little rock. Or do they call them crystals? <laughs> I'm not an expert at this stuff. Let's see. This is an orange calcite. Wow. I... Yeah, but I think that's everything for this crazy random fall haul, but I hope you guys enjoyed it and yeah, look out for more videos in the future. I'm going to be definitely doing like a room makeover with me here in the future. So if you guys are interested in that, then definitely hit the subscribe button if you aren't already. And yeah, that's basically it. I hope you guys all have a great day and I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace.